Carving, carving, carving. Keep them chisels carving. Oh no, I'm addicted. Hey y'all, I'm James Wright and welcome to my shop. This last week has been a blast of a week and I have gotten a ton done and there's a, a whole pile of things to go over in this shop report. So let's jump into it. Uh, this last week I did a video on dovetails, on how to quickly cut dovetails and just the, the simple bare bones, um, no frills, no jigs, no extras, just how do you cut a dovetail with a saw and a chisel and get it done? And I really like how that came out, a lot of good comments from it. Um, just a, a very simple, quick video and uh, yeah, I like that one. I was going to be doing a video on the clogs uh, for the carving challenge with uh, the other two guys, you know, that other Shogun and the Junkie, whatever their names are. Uh, <laughs> but we had a, a few complications and things came up, and uh, so we didn't do that this week. We're going to do that video next week. So if you wanted to see the car, the carving on the clogs, uh, that will be next Saturday's video. Um, but instead of that, I had to quickly whip out another video, so I put together on this mallet, which I am in love with. Uh, this was just a, a fun, quick job. It took me about four hours total with video to whip it out of some stuff I had lying around the shop, throw carving into it, and I have a nice finishing mallet. And so this mallet is for uh, when I want to actually like put together the joints and I don't want to ding up the surfaces, whereas this is a much softer mallet and it won't, uh, won't damage the wood. So that was a fun video and uh, I'm liking the carving. This next week, I'm not 100% sure what Thursday's video will be. It might be um, gang cutting dovetails. In other words, how do you do a whole bunch fairly quickly with hand tools, which I've set up for this, so I can uh, cut the tails on four at a time, and how do you chop out quickly and do a lot of those. Uh, there's a few things that you can do to speed up that process. The other one is possibly doing an intro into carving. You know, how do you do some basic carving um, fairly quickly, fairly simply, and uh, doing a, uh, a camellia flower. This is something that Mary May has popularized, and they're, they're just kind of fun. So I will be doing uh, one of those maybe this Thursday. We will see. Um, and then, of course, this next Saturday, I will be doing the carving of the clogs. So that should be a very fun video. This last week, I got to go to the Midwest Tool Collectors Association meet uh, and tool uh, show, and this was an absolute blast. One of the best I've been to in a long time. This one was in Milwaukee and was a fantastic, fantastic show. I bought a beam, uh, beam drill or a post drill, depending upon what you want to call it. Um, I bought a large cross-cut saw, uh, six foot long. I've been wanting one of those for a while, um, a new set of augers, um, an extension auger, um, a carving knife, and some other things which I've forgotten. I, I spent more than I should have, but uh, it was well worth it and a great time. If you've ever been to a Midwest Tool Collectors Association meet, you've got to look them up, mwtca.org. I'll leave a link in the description below, but a fantastic group and a wonderful place to look for that tool you've been wanting for a long time. There are several more of these meets coming up in the next few months and through the summer, and I will definitely be at them. And then in Springsfield, Illinois, will be the National in June, and I'm really looking forward to that, and I will be at that meet as well. Speaking of meetups, I will actually be in Lancaster, Pennsylvania on March 19th. Um, I'll be at the Starbucks uh, over by uh, um, the Dutch Wonderland, and I'm really looking forward to that. So uh, 6 p.m. at the Starbucks on um, March 19th. I'll have more information in the description below. Um, also, I will be at the woodworking show in Atlanta. Uh, this is the March 30th through the, through the 1st. I'm really looking forward to that one. Uh, so that will actually be well over 50 YouTubers getting together at the show and a huge amount of people to meet and uh, just have a lot of fun. So definitely come for that. It's well worth it. Then immediately after that, on April the 2nd, I'm going to have a meetup with uh, Johnny and Zach from the Crafted Podcast. All three of us are going to get together for a meetup in Asheville, North Carolina. That will be on the 2nd. I'll leave more information to that below. So a lot of chances if you uh, want to get out and say hey if you're in... Let's see, Pennsylvania and Illinois and uh, Alabama and North Carolina. So lots of fun and a lot of things coming up. 
I'm not sure why, but I've actually been selling um, a lot of the uh, Wood by Wright t-shirts recently. Um, so that has been, it's been going quite a bit on the website. I have a few left of this box lot. Um, I'm thinking about putting another order in in the future. I still have uh, medium, large, and I think I have 2X. Um, if you go to my website, you can see a place where you can order them there. But uh, yeah, if you want, uh, want one of those, better hop on them quick. I'm not sure if I'm gonna order more, uh, but uh, I might, we'll see. The other thing that happened this last week is we had the first Patreon mass hangout. And so this is a chance that anyone who is a patron on Patreon can hop on and hang out and say hi um, just online so you can do it anywhere in the world. And we had people on there, let's see, in uh, Ireland and in the Netherlands and in um, uh, New Zealand and then um, down in Mississippi, and there was one other country, and I don't remember where, but all over the place. So um, we'll be doing that once every three months, and that will be open to all patrons on Patreon. Speaking of Patreon, it is time for another monthly giveaway. And I have actually had several people asking me, can you give away a saw? Um, because people are always looking for, particularly where they can get a decent hand saw or panel saw. And so this month we have a late model Distin uh, 24 inch. Um, I freshly sharpened it. It is a five and a half uh, PPI cross cut. And I'm also going to be throwing in a uh, saw set so that you can uh, sharpen and set the teeth yourself. So it should be a, a fun giveaway. This is open to anyone who is a patron on Patreon, and I will randomly do the drawing on the second or third of the month. So if you want to win that, hop onto Patreon. So that's about it for this week. There are a lot of fun things coming up and I'm really looking forward to the meetups this year and getting to meet you all. Um, if you can make it out to any of those, I would love to say hey. Um, so feel free to come on out. Also, I'm trying to get out to the West Coast sometime. I know that kind of gets neglected, so I'd like to be able to do that, but we'll see. So that's about it for this week. I hope you liked it. If you did, please hit like and go ahead and smash that subscribe button. I do want to say thank you to the patrons on Patreon. You guys are the reason that this channel is still here today. If you'd like to to help out with that, you can find out more at the link right over here. Also, if you like this video, feel free to check out one of my others. You might find something you like there. And until next time, have a wonderful day.